shut up and sit down. Hi, hello, I'm the Cyber Roof Guru. Thank you for watching. So it's that time of month again. I'll be unboxing the Maker Geeks, I believe November Maker Geeks Geek Box. So uh, let's get on with it. All right, we will open this guy up. Okay, <clears throat> the choice is clear. Wow, where did 2017 go? It's almost December. Years flown by, blah, blah, blah. So we bring you the raw natural beauty of Maker Series PLA, Maker Series Pet G, and Raptor Series PLA. Okay, what's well, interesting, right? Haven't received uh, Pet G before from them. Uh, so that's a step up from the last box. <laughs> Um, pure resin filaments, sharper resin, sharper, you'll notice sharper and higher resolution prints as well as stronger parts. All three of the resins uh, carry food safe FDA rating, which is good. So we have a, uh, let's see here, we got, uh, take this guy out, we have a Raptor Series PLA Raw Natural Khaki. So, if you guys can see that, let's see if we can zoom in on that. Kind of. See, I'm only just kind of washing it out a little bit. My apologies here. Um, so it's um, it's not white, uh, but it's not, I, I wouldn't characterize this as khaki either. It's not brown. <clears throat> okay. So we have an AHA Natural Clear. Okay, so let's, again, let's. And, uh, zoom in you can see that there a little bit better huh apologize for the lighting I'll have to move that lamp and let's see last one is the crystal series pet G okay what we got here so see that so the the PETG here looks to me to be the most crystal, most clear crystal. The PLA, um, you can see this here. Let me move this out of the way a little bit. All right. You can kind of see here. My apologies. The setup is being suboptimal. So there you go. You can see the colors with the uh, PLA being on this side right here and the pet g being here so you can see how the the pet g is definitely clearer and this has got the uh the the uh, pla is got a little uh, uh amber hue to it for lack of a better uh term all right so let's keep reading here we have a uh, flexible putty knife and maker geeks pins so i found the pins I have found no evidence of a flexible putty knife, so it's not clear what they mean by the flexible putty knife. So let's uh, go ahead and slide that guy out of the way for a moment, and I will show you the pins. So there you go. That's uh, that's pin number one. It's kind of cool. We'll make a geek's owl, and then pin number two. Also, the Maker Geeks Owl. Kind of cool there. All right. So I'll pull the light back down so I can see what's going on. All right. So that's it. Uh, no putty knife, but uh, all clear filaments and a pet G, which is a step in the right direction. Um, I thought for a brief moment there I got white <laughs> again. <laughs> um, but I didn't. So uh, this is going to be fun. I actually have a couple of... Uh, projects that I need to do or a project I need to do with the clear filament so that's going to be that's going to be fortuitous or it is fortuitous I should say so all right uh, any questions or comments please leave them down below I would appreciate a thumbs up if you like the video if you don't like the video also appreciate a thumbs up anyway don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you again next month